The crowd is amped up, ready to get this season underway, as are we. Back with more in a minute. Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. Opening day baseball on the show. It's the Chicago White Sox and the Los Angeles Angels. Alongside Chris Singleton, I'm John Shelby. All right, partner, ready to go. Always a pleasure to get things started with you on opening day. Well, happy new year, buddy. And anyone that's involved in baseball, even though it's not January 1st, this is the start of a new year. Every team has playoff hopes. I love this time of the year. I'm excited to get things going. Los Angeles Angels. So digging in, Gerald Raymond. He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. And that one hammered. This one's got a chance. And gone! An absolute blast to left. His first homer of the year, and they jump out front. It's 2-0. Always scary for a pitcher when a guy can take a fastball down the middle and hit it to the opposite field. No holes in a swing like that. And that time, that ball was hit hard. So up next, Gerald Raymond. This is a true five-tool guy. Not very many of them out there, but when he's on the field, you can't take your eye off of him. Fans come to the ballpark to watch him play. And in baseball, to have such a talented player going out there every day and putting on the oh, show that he that does, one. just a joy to watch. Well, that'll make you feel good as a hitter right there. I could watch base hits like that one all no, day no. long, and Looks so good. could every hitting coach no. in the league. Just a nice no. line drive into center field. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. And now the catcher comes up to him. Alex Levitt. Right-hander kicks deals. And there he goes. Safe at second with a stolen base. Chris, his wheels were the difference maker on that play. Just got in there. Yeah, with StatCast's help, we see his top speed on this stolen base. And that's a big number. I mean, man, he really made his athleticism work for him on that one. Next offering misses, and that's ball three. Hits for average power, the ability to feel the arm, and then the speed, really impressive. Throw to second, save. Now back to second, and he's back again. Raymond, the runner at second with one away. Hey, nice and patient. Get your pit. And ball four to a board. Second walk of the game for him, and he's been really patient at the play. The game plan that he's sticking to, he's just not going outside of what he's looking for up there. So first and second with one man gone. And next for L.A., Ben Luis. Grounded out his first time. Now a check on him at second, back safely. The pitch. And a swing and a miss. And there's two down. Well, they didn't get the call on the mound the pitch before. Felt like he should have had him looking, I think. But, you know, that's good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch to get him to swing and miss. Next offering in the dirt. And yeah, that's ball two. Tough spot right here. A couple runners on. Two ball count. You can't nibble, but you have to execute and finish your pitch. If you leave something out over the plate, it's going to bring in some runs. That one to first. Craig collects. He takes it himself to the bag, and that'll do it. Angels strand a couple as they're unable to add to their 2-0 lead.
Get on for Here's it, a here. speed threat, Gerald Raymond. It's been such a good hitter with runners in scoring position. Some guys just take it to another level. For him right now at the plate, it's like everyone else is in slow motion and he's in full speed. That one ripped and a base hit. McCallum around third. He'll score easily and they lead by three. Well done, drives in the run. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. Now the White Sox manager is out of the dugout and will make a move to the pen. Ralph French, done for the day. It's a three-run game, and we'll be back to tell you about the new arm in a minute. Victor Rodriguez into the game. It's his job to keep his team in the game. Well, at this point of the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and he made a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. And next for the Angels, Alex Levitt. And the righty deals. Into left center for a base hit. Thomas around third. One run in. Here comes another. He's also in to score. And the lead is up to five. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Got a good pitch to drive. Stayed short with his bat path to the ball and caught it out front. And he stayed long in his spot. Base is empty one away. And up next for Chicago, Garrett Moon. Good contact guy. Good defender. One down. Base is empty. And he lays down a bunt. On the run, throw to first. No hit here on the bunt attempt. They get the out. Perhaps he rushed just a little bit, didn't set the angle as the infield was back right there. And that's pretty much a gimme for a bunt base hit. Just didn't quite put it. One out, base is empty. So now the Angel cleanup hitter, Gerald Raymond. With this kind of lead, he can swing freely, try to hit the ball out of the park, do what he loves to do. Swung up, belted. Deep. That one went back there, and that one's going to land not so much here, but here. Another homer, and they add on. It's 6 nothing. Singy, the ball is jumping off his back. Yes, it is. Tons of loud contact. Man, it's been impressive. That's the exact definition of hitting the ball where it's pitched, taking that outside fastball and driving it the opposite way out of the ballpark. You want to bottle that type of approach. Good win by six runs. Always nice when you can win by a touchdown or a couple of field goals. You want to keep that momentum going, knowing the offense can score at will. Bring it into the next one and get another W. 6 nothing is how this one ends. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby saying so long.